Millions of people along a narrow band in North America will look up when the sky darkens during a total solar eclipse on April 8th. Evansville and other parts of the tri-state will be in the path of totality. Meteorologist Cody Bailey has more. The cosmic curtain is about to rise on the greatest show on Earth. A total solar eclipse occurs usually around twice a year somewhere in the world. It is a consequence of the fact that the moon is orbiting around our planet, the Earth. So, usually twice a year, the moon will come directly in between the sun and the Earth, blocking out some or all of its light. The last time totality crisscrossed the U.S. was in 2017, with totality lasting two and a half minutes. So unfortunately, uh, not everyone in the world can see a total solar eclipse. When it happens, you need to be in very specific places. In fact, if you want to see a total solar eclipse, you need to be within a very specific region known as the path of totality. Essentially, that is the place where the moon's shadow is passing over the surface of the Earth. This year, totality will last up to 4 minutes, 28 seconds in some spots. And when it reaches that point of totality, it will be darker, it will be colder as well because the moon is not only blocking the sun's light, it's blocking its warmth as well. And it is important not to look at the sun without protective eyewear. Looking at the sun with the naked eye is incredibly dangerous, so make sure to wear those special eclipse glasses. The sun's UV radiation is capable of destroying the soft tissue in the back of your eyeballs. It's not very nice. It can cause severe and sometimes permanent damage to your vision. The next total solar eclipse in 2026 will grace the northern fringes of Greenland, Iceland and Spain. North America won't experience totality again until 2033 with Alaska getting sole dibs. There won't be another U.S. eclipse spanning coast to coast until 2045. That one will stretch from northern California to Cape Canaveral, Florida. And aside from Carbondale, Illinois, and the crosshairs of both the 2017 and 2024 eclipses, NASA says it usually takes 400 years to 1,000 years before totality returns to the same spot.